Hey what's going on guys, Cody here and I'm back from Mod Showcase today guys and today I'm showcasing the Ore Spawn mod again. So pretty much the Ore Spawn mod, I showcased it back in June for the first release and that added the Kraken and I showcased it again in August and that added in the Cephadrome. Well this update, it adds in the Nightmare and it adds in Mobzilla. So I'll show you what those are afterwards. Those are bosses. Pretty much the Ore Spawn mod, it has bosses up the but um, if you guys want to see a full showcase um, on the other two like updates or whatever check the link in the description or like the annotation somewhere but there'll be a link to go over there um, but yeah let's get started guys and guys when I showcased the mod back in June I think there's 1.8 million views on it the latest one I did was at 200k but you guys got like 7,000 likes on the second one and I think about 11,000 on the first one I know we can't beat 11,000 we could possibly if you guys Atlanteans United but let's try to get Let's shoot for 3,000 likes, guys. Oh, dear God. These birds, they're back. That's one part about this mod I don't like. I'm going to turn my sounds off real quick. They're still there. All right, all right. They died down. Um, but let's try to get 3,000 likes, guys, and I'll showcase the mod again when it updates. Both times at zero. And now let's take a look at the mobs. So the first mobs that we have, this is a, kind of a smaller update. It's more about the bosses. Um, let's turn the sounds back on because the birds, they seem to be gone well hopefully all right so the first thing we have is the lurking terror this thing is so freaking effed up it is kind of like the WTF I'll show you guys the WTF um, how it's just gross if we look at this guy's mouth oh no no not that guy <laughs> oh god what I do okay well anyways the lurking terror it's got 30 health um, the mouth on it is just weird as hell it attacks what is going on <laughs> oh my god um pretty much the lurking terror it uses its mouth and like bites you pretty much um now it will attack any mob um so it's very hostile you have to watch out for that bad boy um but let's take a look well at the thing i kind of spoiled um i don't know what this is i couldn't find any info on it i can't do damage to it um at least I don't think I can, but uh, let's take a look at it. I don't even know. It's got a hundred health. It's called a Trifid. Let's try to shoot it. What? Now I can do damage to it. Wait, maybe because. Hold up. Now I probably now I can't do damage. Let's try the bow again. Yeah. So this thing has to be like open to do damage. Apparently, he is very cool. He's kind of like a mini boss. Um, let's try to get this lurking terror. Cause he seems to not like him. Well, that guy's still flapping. Now, I'm not sure why, but he just randomly opened back up. So, I think once he gets hurt, he takes a little bit to, like, regen. Because he is regening health right now. But, uh, that's pretty much it for the Trifid. He's so cool. He's like a tree. His roots are in the ground. That's awesome. And let's take a look at the last smaller mob. So, this is a Cliff Race. I think it's called Cliff Racer. Um, it's pretty much just another bird. Yep, he would add another bird. That guy is regening a lot. Jeez. So that's a good special ability of the Triffids. Um, but yeah, this guy is just a little... He's got five health. He's very flyish. He flies around. <laughs> Alright, let's go, guys. And let's take a look at the new items. So let's get rid of these guys. Um, those were pretty cool. I do like the Triffid. And now that I know what it does. Um, but let's take a look at the first chest. Um, so this is pretty much all the new items. There wasn't too, too many. But let's take a look at them. So these are zoos. So the modder, I think he wants you to make zoos. Um, I'll put these up here for now. Um, with the animals and stuff. Because there is like gazelles, chipmunks. So if you want to make cages and stuff for them, well, don't spend your time building. Spend your time crafting these bad boys. So the first thing I have in my hand, I think, is an extra small zoo cage. So yeah, we'll place it in. And we're, we're in there. Um, but yeah, that's pretty cool. You get a bunch of iron and glass. I don't know the crafting recipe, but I'm pretty sure this would be, like, an easy way to, like, I don't know, kind of get a lot of iron. Because there's no way you use that much iron in the crafting recipe. I don't know. Um, but let's take a look at the next one. It's getting a little bit bigger. 
Um, it's decent size. Now we have a medium size suit cage. Progressively they get bigger. Here's a medium size. Not too shabby. Large size. And then we get the mega size. Oh, extra large. I mean, this is pretty cool. If we ever did potentially let's play this, you know, we could we could do something like this. Make a zoo. Uh, I'm just giving myself ideas. I don't know. Well, maybe. We'll see, guys. Let us know if you want us to actually do a series on this, like, ever. Um, because it's an awesome mod, and it's got so many bosses. Um, that it'd, I think it'd be cool. Um, I don't want to make a mod pack on it, because it's very unstable. Um, but yeah, pretty much, that is the zoo cages. Now, we do have an extra item here that I haven't tested yet. Instant survival shelter. So. Oh. Well, yeah. Oh, there we go. Whoa. All right, we got furnace. Whoa, we get some supplies in there. All right, I'll take that. That's pretty cool. I mean, yeah, this is, like, good to go if you're traveling and you need a house real quick because the Kraken came. <laughs> I don't think the Kraken give a fuck, though. I think he would just destroy your place. Also, let me know what your favorite boss is because there are so many bosses, and I don't know. There's just a wide variety, and I want your guys' opinion because I think my favorite is going to be the Kraken, the original Kraken. Um, but that's pretty much it for those guys. Let's take a look at the new weapons. Well, this one's not a weapon. It's actually creeper repellent. So, let's get a creeper. And let's get a creeper launcher too. Because that's actually another new item. Um, so it's spawning... Actually, let's place it down. Let's see what this does. So, they just despawn. If they're near that bad boy. Oh, you got pushed... Oh, don't they get pushed away? That's so sick. Alright, so spawn a creeper. And, uh, let's take this creeper launcher. So what you can do with this is just right click, actually left click, and boop. And he's gone. You guys see this creeper right here? And he's gone. Yep, he's gone. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Alright, so what this thing does is pretty much just shoots him in the air, very high. Let's get like a whole line of them. Uh, get some payback on these creepers, a lot of times they jump scared you. Let's go, shoot them up in the air, pinatas. Alright, when they come back down, you can potentially hit them again. I've shot them back up before. Yeah, that guy got shot back up. Um, but yeah, that's Creeper Launcher. Creeper Launcher is one of my favorite items in this mod. I think the Ray Gun, that was one of my favorites before. I'll show you guys that now. Boom! That's sick. Alright, well, that's pretty much it for the items. Um, oh, actually, no, I forgot to show off the swords. So we have the Nightmare Sword, which you actually get from the Nightmare Mob in the Nightmare Dimension. So... They're still adding more Nightmare stuff. Hopefully, they add in some armor or something. That'd be cool. And then we have Big Bertha. So, I think you get this from killing Mobzilla. I'm not too sure. Um, but he is effective on Mobzilla. I'm not going to lie. Uh, Mobzilla, it's a uh, pretty beast. It, uh, it's got a lot of health. <laughs> it's got a lot of, uh, what is it? I'm thinking of the word. Defense. There it is. Um, but yeah, I think this Big Bertha will do the job. It is just, it is massive. Okay, so I do want to say I am a bit sick, so if I sound weird, again, I'm sorry. I get sick, like, all the time here at college, just because, I don't know, everybody gets sick, and then there's a lot of people, and then you all get sick. It's weird. Um, but anyways, let's take a look at the, what the hell? He is a checkerboard. Uh, let's take a look at the new mobs. So, Mobzilla, and the Nightmare, oh, and the Unstable Ant. Well, let's take a look at the unstable ant first. So, spawn that bad boy in. Right click him. We actually get teleported to a new dimension that's work in progress. Right now, it's kind of like a flat world. Um, there is some tower. Oh, there they are. Not towers, like um, floating land. And they have some awesome loot. I hope he adds some, like trees and stuff. I mean, you know, that black leaf texture, I guess. Make it look very nightmarish. Um, but the diamond block. And then we have some other awesome ores and under these i found this i do not know what this is oh okay now i do dark floating island so the float the island is alive and it's gone so it should just like crash down or something um but on these platforms the nightmares will actually spawn uh these bad boys so let's time set night and see if they do spawn i haven't really seen one yet but i've heard rumors that they do Maybe because it's work in progress. Um, alright, well, oh, gold blocks. Oh, no, what is that? It is, 
Uranium. Oh, that's very useful. Well, anyways, let's spawn the nightmares. So, there he is. Look at that model. They get they vary in size. I'll show you the bigger size. He looks like a hammerhead shark, with like the fin of like a shark on the on his head, top of his head, and those teeth. Oh my god! I think I have a toy that looks just like him. When I was a kid, you could just open the jaw and shut it. Look at the tail. This guy's amazing at animations. I do want to say that. Wow. And he's gone. <laughs> he's taken off. Let's try to find a big one here. Oh, jeez. That's the second biggest one. So it can even get bigger. Oh my god. Dude, you are massive. That is so cool. Alright, let's try to find the bigger one. What is that? That's 150 health. Another 300. Oh, 300 health. Um, I can't find the map. <gasps> there it is. Big Daddy. No, I think it's the same size. They're just all huge. Uh, there's huge variation. And once in a while, you'll get a massive one. I don't want... Oh, there it is. 450 health. He is a beast. He is com completely, like, destroying that island. He is that big. Well, uh, let's head back to the regular dimension. Spawn this bad boy again. Try to head there. <laughs> Alright, need to freehand. So we're back. I don't know where my set is. But let's take this Mobzilla. And uh, let's show him around. Let's make him have a good time. Alright. So let's spawn this guy. Are you guys ready? This is going to be a big fight. Uh, um, Alright. Three, two, one. There he is. Mobzilla. You are just massive, dude. Look at that. You look, you look sad. Oh, head's moving. He's jumping. Look at the spikes on him too. He's just huge. How many health? He has four thousand health. He does not even. His foot shows up on a damage indicator thing. That's so cool. That is awesome. Well, let's get our bow. All of our stuff here. We're ready to go. Um. Well, he's got a lot of health, and he's very hard to take down because of all his defense. He tries to find different villages and just destroy them. Re wreak havoc. Um, now he's very hard. Oh, he's very hard because he does do so much damage. And like, the only way you can fight him, I think, is with his ultimate armor, because he'll just one hit you otherwise. Um, now he does have a few attacks. He has a lightning attack where he shoots lightning everywhere, and then he has the fireball attack where he shoots fireballs out of his face. Oh God, <laughs> let's get away from him. Um, yeah, he's just going crazy. He destroys blocks. His arms are freaking out. Let's uh, show him this big Bertha. Oh my god. <laughs> Jeez, yeah, he knocks you back, so he's very hard to get close. And he regens so much. I mean, I can't even kill him in creative mode. Oh, he just jumped on us. Ah, oh, jeez, that Godzilla noise. Oh, he's, he's getting pissed. He usually just goes on a rampage, and I think he's more interested in me, though, right now. Oh god, I'm stuck in here. Let's take him out. At least try to. <laughs> we got him pinned. I don't think we're going to kill him anytime soon. Mobzilla, you are massive, dude. He's the hardest boss, I think, in here. Alright, let's try to get in GM. And let's kill him in GM. At least try to. His arms are freaking out, though. So he does 100... Uh, this does 100 damage. Even though it's supposed to do 500 damage. So you can just tell from how much freaking... Uh, defense he has. Oh, we can, we can take him out. Alright, two seconds, guys, and I'm gonna try to kill him. Alright, guys, so he's almost dead. He's got, I think, 86 health. Let's finish it. Oh, my god. I've never seen him dead before. What did we even get? Let's, like, clear our inventory, and let's just see what we get for loot. Oh, dear god. Are you kidding me? I, I gotta kill him. I have to. Dick. He would do this. Me and him have history. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. We get some crazy loot here. Godzilla. Oh, ultimate swords. Our Mobzilla. Not even Godzilla. I think Mobzilla would kill. Destroy Godzilla. Oh my god. That is so much loot. Well, as you can see, it just goes everywhere. You get a bunch of XP. Um, let's see what we got for loot. Ultimate. Or actually, experience sword. Ultimate tools. I thought I saw an ultimate sword. It might have been this one. 
Um, but that's some crazy good loot, guys. I hope you enjoyed this showcase. Um, be sure to leave a like. And also, do want to show you something real, real quick. Um, we'll get Mobzilla back out here just to say hello. Um, so what we can do is spawn this Mobzilla, and then we can spawn these nightmares, and they'll actually fight, which is so cool. You just have like a minions after. Um, you have like your own little army after them, but I think the nightmares will attack you too. So <laughs> we get some giant ones. Oh, jeez. Oh, that's, no, that's even bigger than the one I showed before. That's got 600 health. Oh, my God. That is so, <laughs> that is so epic. Um, but that's pretty much it for the showcase, guys. Be sure to leave a like. I want to see, like, a cool mob battle where nightmares take on mobzillas. That'd be so cool. See how many nightmares it takes. Um, but, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to leave a like, and let's try to hit that 3,000. And, uh, peace.